Hey, what's up everyone? This is a quick little video on an issue I'm having. Uh, the fuel gauge isn't working, the meter, not the uh, idiot light. So those two yellow wires, the far one on this left side, or my right, is to test the idiot light. The one on the far bottom right is to check for the gauge itself. on the fuel you ground that wire out wait about maybe 20 seconds or so and the meter should be rising up um, I didn't know that at first and um, I, I probed it and my gauge meter was going up so it's my sending unit so with that being said I took the sending unit off I took it off a while back but didn't realize that there was corrosion. It's all corroded. So I'm gonna go ahead and clean this up and get this, I don't know, probably sandblasted, not too sure. Probably just sand it by hand and use a acetone. But yeah, the, the float inside there, it, it was floating, but it wasn't giving any power to the gauge. So quick little tip this casing right here you're gonna want to pull this off do not pull the wire this wire is soldered on to that sensor this doesn't come off but you're gonna have to twist and pull at the same time grab it from this section twist and pull and it'll come off you're gonna want to remove this shield there's three little tabs that's what it looks like it's all corroded get that clean Here's the sending unit all repaired, cleaned up, painted the top black, sandblasted the whole housing, top and bottom, including that case. I wrapped the lower sensor with a plastic bag along with a float, taped it up. I didn't want to get that um, filled with any type of debris from the sand. Cleaned up the whole inner inside as well. Made sure I didn't damage that wire. So I'm gonna go ahead and install this and put the key on for it and see what it does. Okay, let's check out the meter. So now that the fuel gauge is working, I need to figure out the issue on the oil gauge. I'm gonna check the wires on that, see what's going on. I could purchase a new oil gauge uh, aftermarket, but I do wanna keep it stock for now. Um, the oil pressure sensor is new. It may have gone out. So if anything, I'll order a new one perhaps OEM, if not better, and see what happens from there. So on the gauge, oil pressure gauge, um, I think it might be the butt connector that goes to the sensor or the sensor itself. I went ahead and took off the wire, have my probe, and um, I'm just grounding it so the light comes on. And the gauge shoots up. Well, not all the way up, but. So, I'm gonna have to either buy a new sensor or fix the butt connector because it, it's a regular connector that I had to take off and um, clip on there. Can't get down there and see it, but uh, yeah, so that's my issue either the sensor or that butt connector.